Welcome back to Fox 8 News in the Morning. I'm Stephanie Schaefer, and I hope you're having a great start to your day. You know, many students are learning from home. Most of them are, and each of their classes look a lot different than ever before, including physical education, gym class. Well, one gym teacher is making sure his students stay engaged and keep having fun virtually and stay active. Jason Hain from Redwood Elementary School in Avon Lake is joining us live right now. And you never stop moving, obviously. How are you? It's good to see you. Hey, good to see you guys, too. Well, you know, you got to get your 60 minutes of physical activity in each day. Yes. All right. How are you motivating these kiddos to do that? You're the gym teacher, the phys ed teacher, and you're still holding class. Is that right? Yes. Well, number one, don't stop moving, right? I only have them for a certain amount of time, so they got to see me energetic. They got to see me with a smile on my face. And when I see them, they know that we are ready to go. We are getting moving. They're online, they're at home, so they're going to take those chairs, they're going to move those chairs away, they have a wired headset. That's the time to disconnect it because you can't have wires on when we're being active in the house. Jason, talk about these videos that you're creating, too, that, uh, that really help engage them to get up and get moving. Well, you know, our students are right now dealing with some challenges they normally wouldn't face. One of them is their environment. So normally they're used to walking into a gym, and a gym is an exciting place to be. That they don't have, so I'm just trying to recreate that just in a different way. So I try to use colorful backgrounds. I got little characters popping up on my videos. Sometimes we may wear like some funny hats. Uh, this week is wacky hat workout. <laughs> so, so, so kids just wear their wacky hats? Yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And if they don't have one, they just use their imagination. That's more powerful than anything. Talk about how you're engaging them and what the feedback is like. And I love all of the messages that you have about a healthy um, mind and a healthy body and, and how it all really helps, especially now. We talk about that we're stuck in the house. We don't have our friends to engage in as much as we're used to. And especially for young people, it's vital, it's crucial, it's so important. Um, how is that? your motto well i can tell you you know 60 minutes of physical activity each and every day you saw i introduced that i really want that to be planted in a mindset for them so that when they leave me they have uh they have a goal to shoot for throughout the week right so how are they going to get their 60 minutes and they're stuck at home they have to be a little creative i'm here to try to help them do that i try to make videos that they can watch when they want on their own through youtube so if they're they're stuck in the house at a certain point in the day when they have class with me and it's raining maybe they could take that video on youtube use mom or dad's phone go outside and watch it later and get that workout in I love and as it. far as you create sorry no go ahead go ahead i was gonna say as far as the creativity piece uh you know it kind of goes something like this like uh you know stephanie I, I i think you have some some dirt on your outfit okay it's time to get out the washing machine all right let's get our elbows out and we're gonna start twisting now, to everyone else in the world, this is just a normal twist. But to my kids, it's the washing machine. And then we start using our elbows and touching our knees. And it's about taking something basic, something simple, maybe even a little boring, and just adding that spin on it. I love your creativity, and I know the kids are loving it too. You also encourage kids to be engaging and try new things. Why is that so important? It's important because when you have an opportunity like physical education class, many students at that point in the day, they may be a little, uh, a little scared, a little nervous to try something physical. Maybe it's something they never did. And usually they're surrounded by their peers that could see them complete that activity. So allowing them the opportunity to practice something new physically moving their body in a way that they're not used to is so extremely important because if you could tone in and allow them to have success at that, that goes towards the rest of their life with anything that they do. Jason, you actually won contests doing these kinds of things a couple of times for your school. Is that right? Well, yes, uh, our, our fourth grade students won the contest. All I did was help them make the video, but those, those, those kids, our children, or our, our students are the real winners. So. That was a youth movement contest sponsored by the Community West Foundation and the Cleveland Clinic. And our fourth grade students, in the for the last two years, we were lucky enough to win it two years in a row. Uh, the grand prize was $5,000. And for the month of February, they used move bands and tracked their fitness. They competed against other schools in Northeast Ohio. And we were lucky enough to win it the last two years. So, you are super uh, awesome, like teacher of the year. Can other kids outside of Avon Lake see you? I notice right above you, you have your YouTube page. So can parents use you as an extra resource? 
Oh yeah, if, if, if parents need a few extra moving activities to get their kids moving that 60 minutes a day, they can log in right up there and they can watch some of those videos. I love it. You are awesome. You're so creative, so engaging, and I know the kids Thank absolutely you. love you. You totally remind me of Jim Tomey too, by the way. <laughs> he really do. He's a great guy. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. Keep engaging and inspiring those kids. It's really fantastic. You're the best. All right. Thank you. He's inspiring me. So I'm going to run around the studio as we take a commercial break. We will be right back. Washing machine. I'm out of here.